guys, what's up? It's Tess and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a super casual, just a vlog style room tour. A lot of you guys have been asking me for this and I also just repainted my room. It used to be yellow, but I was getting kind of sick of it and I just wanted to freshen it up a little bit. So I painted it white and I painted it on my own. It took three days, so it doesn't look perfect, but hopefully you can't tell. I have paint like all over my floor because I refused to use a drop cloth and now I know why you're supposed to use a drop cloth. So yeah, I'm gonna start over here by my door and I feel like a couple of you guys have noticed this but I don't have a doorknob which is so weird but it broke off a few years ago and I just haven't fixed it so yeah that is my door and when you walk in right here is a huge mirror this is in like a door frame because this used to be a door and then under it is chalkboard paint because it used to be chalkboard paint for me and my friends to draw on but I just put in this huge mirror and then if you move to the right I have this old bookshelf that I turned into kind of like a shoe display so these are some of my favorite shoes. Most of them are Jeffrey Campbell. These four are Jeffrey Campbell. And then these ones are from LF. The brand is cute to the core. And then over here, I have this little palm tree and it's in this little planter that I bought at Target recently. And I'll link everything down below if it's still available. A lot of the stuff I got like a really long time ago, but yeah, this bean bag is from Pottery Barn. And then this blanket my grandma knitted me and it's my favorite. And then obviously that's my computer. And then right here I have this little jewelry hanger and I made this in a DIY video. I'll link it down below. It was one of my first videos, but I still have it and I love it. So this is what this area of my room looks like. And then you move over here and I have this little vanity and I got this vanity from an antique store So can't link that down below with the chair as well, but I love it It's so miniature and cute and then I just have all the makeup that I normally wear up here and the skincare that I usually use And then all my brushes and mascara and stuff are in these little mason jars that I also made in that DIY video So I will make sure to link that down below and then I have this little box that I put bobby pins and random rings in this is my grandma's um, and then in this drawer is just the makeup that I most frequently use. And then let's see, I have this flower crown. I wore this in a photo shoot. It's not focusing, but now it's all dried out, so I keep that there. And then I have these records up here, Beatles, Abbey Road, Rolling Stones, Let It Bleed, and Lana Del Rey Paradise. So I have those displayed. And then up here I have this chandelier and my mom actually found this at an estate sale. So I really, really like this. And then if you come over here in this corner, I have these two little boxes. I got these at Home Goods recently and they're just really good for storing things. So in here I just store some makeup and cosmetic stuff that I don't use that often. And then underneath I just use this huge one for kind of like electronic slash camera stuff that I don't use all the time. So that's what that's for. And then I just have some random candles. And then I have this tree branch that I took from outside, literally from like a tree that's out there. And I just hang my dream catchers on that. So I just thought that was kind of cool to put in the corner there. And then over here, my yoga mat, tripod. And then here is my dresser. And this is from Pottery Barn, but it used to be white and my mom and I completely redid it. So we put this kind of a stain on it and tried to crackle it. It didn't really turn out how we were expecting, but I think it looks kind of cool. And then I bought these knobs at Anthropology just to kind of spice it up a little bit because I've had this dresser since I was like so little. So it needed a little bit of a revamp. And then over here, this little thing is is from Italy from one of my friends and then up here I found this crate in my attic a little while ago I don't know oh champagne it's a champagne crate and I turned it into this little sunglass holder and I just thought it looked pretty cute so I use this for my sunglasses and then some random makeup palettes and then I have this fake succulent from Target this candle from TJ Maxx I think and then my journal another candle this has some random jewelry in it. And this is a vintage Polaroid camera that my dad got me for my birthday a long time ago, but it's broken at the moment. So I need to go get that fixed. And I'm just gonna open these right now because they're freakishly clean and normally they're not. So I just cleaned out my closet. I'm gonna be selling some of my clothes soon. I think I'm gonna open a Depop account. So be on the lookout for that. But yeah, these are my kind of like tank top slash 
crop top shirts and then here are t-shirts flowy kind of shirts and then long sleeves more t-shirts and these are the sweaters that i wear most often and then down here this is hard to do with one hand this is where i keep my shorts and my jeans pajamas workout stuff that's really dusty and <laughs> cat hairy and then underwear socks junk drawer and then we move over here and this oh well this is my hamper and then this is my closet it's really messy right now so i'll just show you guys briefly jackets i don't know why that dream catcher is right here hat and then here's all the stuff that i hang up and there's my diploma um art supplies random stuff more shoes and oh yeah my bed okay i feel like this is like the most important part okay so this is my bed i got this at tj maxx but the brand is cynthia rowley and it's really simple but it has this really cute lace trim on it so i'll link that down below if i can find it and then i have this other blanket at the end of the bed and then here are my pillows and i just got all new pillows i'm obsessed with this one it's from home goods this one is also from home goods this one is from target this is the same Cynthia Rowley. And then this one is also from Home Goods. Then I just put some fairy lights on my bed, and my bed itself is from an antique store. So I'm not sure where you can find one similar, I guess, an antique store. But yeah, and then I have this dream catcher that I made also in that DIY video. And then this random hat is hanging up. What else? Um, here are some shoes that I frequently wear. All of my other shoes are in my closet. And then here's all the paint on my floor. But I think that's, oh wait, my bedside table over here. I just have this candle, some matches, another fake succulent from Target. This is from Bali. Here is my lamp. And then I just have some lotion. But I'm pretty sure that is it for my room. Let me show you guys an overview from all angles. I don't know what the best angle is. But shoes, tree, vanity this is my room so that is going to be it for this video today guys thank you so much for watching and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already again i will link everything down below that i can find and thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye